Saving the room? Okay. Saving, I think. So let's test. One, two, three, testing! So let's test. One, two, three, testing! So let's test. I have a confirmed test. My words are not heard. I'm just learning new things about mob spawning. Look how this guy spawned. giant tree starting from the bottoms of the earth as you can see I've 
done. Do uh, kind of high, not something crazy. I mean, it'll be a. Uh, it's a massive tree. As you can see. This is uh, kind of being outlined right now. However, what I'll be doing today, or just to start off right now, is I'll be laying the foundational wooden pillars or circles, if you will, to get this going. So let me first go some of these in my storage system. There you go. And by the way, this isn't really this yet, so I'll put that in there. I'll deliver her rockets when she... Yes, I do. <laughs> um, I'm going to do some of this first. So I actually have a lot of it already, thanks to my lovely girlfriend. And she's been very busy harvesting these trees right here for me. Like, like a mad woman, just harvesting these trees. I will be oops. I will be using all of this wood here that she's kindly harvested for me in a massive uh, jump start to this trip. And the way I'm gonna do it here, just because kinda of on the outside this looks ugly and I'm a big fan of kind of taking um, shortcuts on things, especially if it's like a good shortcut. Let me get started with this top rim first, so that at least aesthetically on the outside, it looks pretty good. And um, I'll get it pretty decently high. It looked like a stump at first, but um, that's okay. The, the magic is going to be once you're actually inside, which is going to be awesome. And you know, honestly, who knows? I may actually like the idea of a stump, because, you know, it, it, this, the whole idea of this is... I just saw my girlfriend. She's actually getting ready to go with her. Those. She, see, we both share the same firework supply, and so we need a creeper farm like bad. I already have a sugar cane right there, which is beautiful. But we need we need the gunpowder, and uh, yeah, we need the ASAP. But, uh, anyway, I like to have just complete emptiness in my blocks. There you go, just a fair amount. Come over here, man. That water saved me right now. I can't believe I almost died. Like that. So, everyone, welcome to the next two hours of my stream. Streaming Minecraft, I respect those of y'all who actually watch it, even though I'm one of them. I, I like watching stream Minecraft because it's awesome when it's on a server and an active server at that, which I happen to be on. It was really cool. There's actually only three people on, which is so uh, kind of uh, kind of normal, honestly. Like even on the slowest times, you got like three or so people. outer ring is just to be the outer ring eventually like the majority of this ring will actually be being built from the bottom up those granite slabs down there actually represent sort of like bounding boxes of this of this giant log that will be here soon and uh, you see my 
girlfriend right over there. Hard to work. I'll tell you what. Appreciate that very much. Okay. Yeah, this. I don't know why. I'm gonna tear this old. This is supposed to be a modern house. So, I had this original plan to make sort of like a, a very, uh, a much smaller tree, let's put it that way. Well, my plans changed when I got a change of inspiration, so I have to, oh my god! change of plans um, because of kind of the way I, I this this storage system actually changed it all to be honest with you I built the storage system and I actually kind of started it and stopped it and then I was like all right this thing's been sitting here half built I basically had all like the chests and stuff on the inside all set up and everything and you know it's cool and all but then um, I was like all right um, I need to finish the rest of this. Like, the redstone definitely is the most challenging part of any big project like that. Oh. oh. Hello. Random floating um, line. Must have missed you somewhere. <laughs> oh, look at them just hanging out together. I'm gonna shoot fire at them. Fire. Fire. I just love flying with this election. Man. Let's go take a quick. please. That was a problem with 114. Why I didn't update for a long time, despite all the new and exciting things in 114 that I you know, was also excited about, but yeah, this, this is really annoying, especially if you were in like church, you know, most of us in sort of do now. This is Eric's base. Is, ouch. is uh I think it's beautiful. I like the way he's like I, I like when you take functional things and you make them pretty. And this is just a sheep farm. He's got a bunch of different color sheep, you know, just different colors that he's trying to get more of. I, I think it's awesome because it's like in a castle. Right? I feel like it's like an abandoned castle at this point. And that was taken over by uh, pretty red but it's it's just very architecturally sound and you can't argue with the detail he's put into this it's it's very noticeable and it's very much well done look at this this is lighting this is like so he doesn't have to have torches around here although i think this is not that good of lighting yeah you see he's got oh that's okay yeah he's got a couple spawnable blocks right here that um Make this a little dangerous, but you know, um, I don't think this is main base. This is just sort of like an aesthetic thing. And honestly, it's not even done here. Got that kind of fireplace, nice touch. And if we go up, if we go out here, you'll see Eric has made. I'm kind of walking too, because I want to kind of get the feel of it. You know, I'm kind of flying around. It's not my crap. Not your. Not your first Minecraft experience. Let me see. Yeah. So 
better here. It's barely long enough. Okay. Nope. Oh, got a couple other characters there. Okay, we got Ganon. Zelda herself. The Master Sword. And the Triforce. The Triforce. I failed that actually. It's supposed to bounce. Um, it's bouncing. Yeah. Yes, the Eric made. It's pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. And slime is slow to walk on. Okay, pretty good. Alright, and I'm gonna do, I am gonna do a really quick cool inside the Eric's face let's get this bamboo. Make it as much as see. I just need to know. Basic function of it, and I can figure out the rest. I gotta build it. <laughs> it took. It took. <laughs> what are these cats doing? Felix and Evil. Oh. oh my god, he's got a black. I'm so jealous of him. I want all these cats. Oh my god. Um, that's his pumpkin on the farm. Let's go. signal is looking at this block. And look at this block is a flash of the rest of the signal, which is happening because this is signal. signs. Awesome. I don't think he meant to do it like that. Because, uh, they changed the way the signs work in terms of the colors and stuff. And I'm sure there might have been something coded um, to just make, like automatically make all your signs all the new color of woods and that might have not been what Eric intended. Because Eric's very aesthetically uh, sound in his builds. Bounce house, this castle area, the house especially. That's the bridge. We're going back to the base because I got a lot of us in here. A lot more. We're going to get to the these tobacco fields to work.
I stuck the landing. Oh, we almost did our first circle. First circle done, and really the the real point of all this is to actually just get. I got a lot of work to do down there, and that's really, really what I'm trying to focus on. And the whole point of this is just to get some sort of like actual like top pieces looking good. I'm just going around right now, yeah, filling up this stuff here that I missed. And this will all get built up from the bottom at some point. And actually not even too far from now because this is all again just to make the top look a little nice because it's very much under construction and I know that everyone who has to look at it knows that and uh, yeah. Yeah. try to keep I just, I'm trying to keep my builds pretty these blocks is uh, being done on purpose because you know I have to look down if I look to the side like if I want to do it here which I of course can do it but if I did it like this look at that can't have that can't have that because this little texture looking to the side nope I'll spot it a mile away that's not what proper tree of life's um, that's not what proper tree of life's um, Taken into consideration. Okay, so that's that should be th up to th three high, uh, or really what I'm looking for is 67. So just basically, just one of the sea level. That's fine. So now we're actually gonna go. This is the trickier part is I want to kind of connect all this stuff here, but um, not necessarily to yet. You see, because as soon as I connect the edges, this is a pro this is how big Minecraft can be. Is just simply connecting this hole to the base of this trunk right here is actually a project in its own. I got tear from this entire circle. This is a, a 39 by 39 wide circle. So you know, 39 that way, that way. This is a lot of terrifying. There's a fucking thing over here. And I actually have a, a plan for this hole, which is why it's marked out. Okay. It's marked out. And I have big plans for this hole. That's just really what really cool. And so that top part is done. I am going to do a lot more of that. At some point. I am probably not going to make it a straight between these two. But uh, I have more. You know, I have a lot of wood, as you can see here. Oh, <laughs> she filled up the other box. You know, my girlfriend's been so good. I need to get her another shulker box of wood here. And actually, what I might do is just, you know, um, I can actually put this down there, which is what I will do. And I did not make a way for a moment. So, you know, let me just do this thing. I do this all the time. This is what I'm so guilty of. I'll be like, Oh, I'm just gonna go to my base really quick, and I'll just be like over here doing this shit, like really minuscule shit that could have waited, but I see I should probably get as much of it as I can. It's like this position that I'm in, I'm gonna be building up, and this one that I'm in right now is very advantageous. Uh... Oh yeah, I got it. I got two actually, and back to digging my hole.
Uh, oh, she threw eggs in earlier in the stream. <laughs> That's right, I'm here to slingshot. I uh, need to get her on Discord call because I need to. I need to actually. I need rockets so bad. And, um, uh, we have Kevin on the server who has a creeper farm already. I actually a really good one, uh, and it's awesome. But uh, yeah, you know, you know, it's a fun project, and uh, we have a plan for it. It's gonna be some supplies working. Yeah, that's all connected up here, so, you know, it's just working, working action right there. Pause it, all of that, there you go, boom, done, and all of those items will get sorted automatically into the storage system. Beautiful, walk away. Next. I love that so much. I'm on that high from just completing, like, that project, and it is just, seriously, you should just make a storage system. Wanna... Project like like a real like a real project tier. Gotta gotta make it some more So we are gonna need um, some supplies. Gathering supplies. Uh, we're gonna need a lot of sand. So first things first. Let's uh, just fill this up really quick. Uh, this is basically how the store system works. Is, uh, you notice how the items immediately went in there because I'm actually mid storing it like right now. There we go. Okay. So basically, it's just a humongous hopper chain that's gonna go up this entire thing, and uh, it's not like completely smart, you know. Like you still have to like like obviously work right now. I know like you have to do some manual things. That's just right now because I just got started with this thing, but. Uh, these are all input chests. They're pretty awesome how they work. Uh, basically, you know, I can put stuff in this chest right here, and it'll start to filter out through the whole system, like, guaranteed. But if, say, I have, like, a ton of wood on me, which I just did a second ago, so I don't know why I went over here. But, uh, okay. Um, if I have a ton of wood, for example, I could have just gone right here and deposited it into this chest, because then it would just immediately make its way to this module and continue onward. And as you can see right here, Oh, what's getting stored? Awesome. So we're gonna need a couple shulker boxes because I'm gonna get more of these too. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be something that sucks up on me. I need some feathers. I use these feathers right now as sort of like filler. Just what I just did a second ago. sand and 
My goodness, we're gonna need a lot of we're gonna need a lot of sand. Holy We're gonna need a lot of sand. Hmm. Yep, we're we're gonna need a lot of sand. Oh shit. No, fill it up. Okay. Um yeah, I didn't realize how much sand I'm actually going to need. That's a lot of fucking sand, actually. Okay. Double check that. Do I have any oh. That's good, too, because I needed a reason to, to kill all this red sand. I had so much red sand. Okay, so now we need a fuel source, which I have good amounts of it yeah all right so basically what i did last time i needed to do this is i just lined up a crap ton of furnaces and i smelted a fuck ton of it so and that's just gonna have to do this time too there you go that will be this will be the like the what needs to be done chest in terms of You're in my headset. Let me fix this. Uh, let me call you back really. Let me jump back in the call. Give me one second. Okay. <laughs> I had to fix my mic. I'm still streaming, so I was I have all the audio and different things in that. All oh, I see. That set up a certain way. <laughs> Man, I had, I had such an utter fail today. You fell down my hole. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. But, but that's not the reason why it was a fail, though. Then what was the reason? Other than how could there be more of a reason? Other than well, that? well, I mean, that was the end result. Well, because it was so bad, but because <laughs> I didn't use streaming, I did to crash and throw eggs at you. <laughs> oh, I, you did that when I was having like technical issues. <laughs> but I ended up dying. And I was like, Damn. <laughs> fail. I know I failed. If anything, you just had to be the guy who kept to take all my stuff because I died. <laughs> yeah. Which it did. I, I helped. I did that. No, thanks. <laughs> okay, so right now, uh, babe, I'm gathering a ton of resources to start our uh, our creeper farm project right now. Oh, really? Yep. And uh, we are gonna be. I'm gonna be heading right to the area right now. So you're welcome to uh, come on over with me. I'm just kind of gathering like the last uh, bit of supplies that we need okay. for this. Um, so it's going to be two parts. It's going to be part one of, um, making the, the perimeter, which is the hole. And, uh, do we need buckets? No, we shouldn't need buckets. Okay. And then part two is actually smelting all the glass, uh, from all the sand we'll be using. So part one will be putting the sand, making the perimeter. And then part two will be once that sand is placed, uh, using glass to border the perimeter and then removing the sand between. So that's basically it. That's that's about what we're able to do today, to be honest with you. Um, okay. Uh, I am almost done grabbing some. I'm I'm by base. We do need a lot of blocks, so I'm just make sure I have plenty. Oh yeah, I, should, awesome. I have probably most many blocks. I always overpack my blocks. Jesus. Mm -hmm. and, and then, oh yeah, and we're gonna need a ton of wood, so I'll just bring all this wood and. Uh, and oh shit! Oh. Right oh. I got a hairy one, and it crushed right. me under the brushes. <laughs> Every day. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> for me, though, I really did. Like, I, I gave it bone meal and it turned into one of those big uh, hairy bushes, and I had to like, crawl. I had to crawl under it because there's so much bush. <laughs> I see. I, I was like, what are you talking about? No, 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 talking about the, <laughs> With the trees. Yeah. Yeah, I like the super long trees. Because <laughs> they're, they're, they're easier to cut down. <laughs> and you get more. <laughs> I'm not ready for all this redstone. <laughs> I'm just potting some trees. I have enough supplies now. I am falling down my hole. Now I'm flying up. I see you. I am flying over the air then. Can you see me? Uh, hold on, I see you. I just need to jump. Wait, oh, oh, I see you. Okay. I see you. Yes. Shit. <laughs> I see you too. I see you struggling. <laughs> hey! Like, don't so be <laughs> If I had my off to find, I'd be like zooming in on you. <laughs> I know. Good damn it. Okay, I gotta focus. <laughs> you know, I'm kind of having a hard time flying today too. I wonder if the server is laggy. Maybe open my wings. I just did it, and it actually did it. So it's kind of lame. But I'm not even getting that glide emotion when you glide. Yeah, the server's lagging right now. It's probably not helping that I'm, like, streaming and stuff. So I think that's why. I think it's starting to take effect. Yeah. And I've actually fallen so. down a hole a couple times. I can't fly. Okay, I'm gonna go back to chop some wood. <laughs> Wait, well, come over here. We gotta build the scrimmer farm. Well, how? We can't fly. You don't need to fly. We're not gonna be flying at all. Oh, I'm literally okay. over here, babe. Just, <laughs> just swim. Dude, just swim. <laughs> no, I will fly. <laughs> <laughs> Well, no, because because you said, oh, we can't fly, but I thought you said we we're flying to the place. No, we're going right here. Okay, hold on. Ugh. I see. Mm, I see. So actually, you see all this kelp? Mm-hmm. That's where you go. Because basically, if you look down here, this is the area. Basically, like this kind of area right here. I see. This is what I'm going for. Because I, because once the, all the kelp is gone, like, I'm going to throw out some of that. Once all the kelp is gone, <laughs> like, it's going to be nice and oh. flat. We're not going to need to remove that like, cubby in the water. I was like, do you have any water breathing potions? Uh, yeah, I'll get a, uh, I'll get a conduit over here, actually, and, um, we'll, we'll be able to do that, but for right now, we don't need to be underwater right now. Um, oh, I'm just... All I need you to do is just, like, if you see any kelp, just go to the bottom and just, like, break the kelp. Yeah, yeah, I, I noticed that as soon as I hit the bottom, they all, like, die. Sugar cane. We have the paper. Wow! Look at all that kelp in the water, babe. 
I don't know. Oh my god, it is so I feel much like, help I, as screenshot worthy. I feel like we're just killing the environment. We are just <laughs> actually killing the environment. You're actually right. Yeah, we're killing the environment. That is kind of sad, but uh... <laughs> I just, I just hope I'm getting the right area and I'm going to the left or something. Oh no, we're good, we're good. Actually, let me actually show you the area. Let me get some uh, breath first, and then I will show you what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. So look, I'm gonna actually lay out for you the area right now. Actually, this is wrong. It's actually this. Oh, this is wrong. I don't even know where you are. I'm underwater. Oh, I'm both around. Oh, yeah, I see you. I'm down the, uh, the border underneath. Right I now. see. So basically... This border is around a chunk, just a single chunk, and this chunk is going to be where this farm is located, and it's going to have about seven platforms, and I'm drowning. Oh, it's kelp. And this chunk, the way the farm is designed to work is, um, while we are over this chunk, it should load a crap ton of creepers, and they should all essentially die to their deaths, their horrible deaths, at the 